about you about the playgrounds. Uh, when yeah. we first uh, communicated, you, I told you that I know that you're a legend in the New York yeah. New York playground. How what how that started? This story, my my young my young age, I get a real emotional because of my high school coach Vincent Smith, Pierre Turner. Those are all the guys that made me into something by playing basketball. You know, I had the skills to play the game, but uh, I didn't really get it. I didn't really get it. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I, and so, then I went to my high school, Archbishop Malloy, where I got my, I always, I always wear my cap. Yeah. And I think about my high school coach, Jack Curran, who uh, taught me the game. You could play the game, but he taught me about life. He taught me about uh, understanding everyone that comes in your corner that's 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 raising you. Mm -hmm. And so, um, Archbishop Malloy meant a lot to me. Um, and that's where it all began for me, at Archbishop Malloy High School. And um, just, uh, I just thank God that I was able to attend Archbishop Malloy I, for, for high school scholarships. You know, I, I got a high school scholarship and um, mm -hmm. I couldn't afford Malloy. It was a Catholic school. But uh, Howie Lawrence coached the girls in my neighborhood of Queens, uh, paid my tuition. What about your nickname, Mr. Jibs? Was yeah, it? Mr. Jibs is my mother. My mother's name. My mother named me um, about four. <laughs> Tell four me days about old. that story. Yeah, four years. Yeah, old, my yeah. four. My four days. Four days in the hospital. Mm -hmm. They bring her. They bring me to her. So she's going around. She's eating. She says she eats chibs. It comes out chibs, and she kept it. <laughs> she kept chibs, and when I went home, I went home. It was, it was my name was my name was Kenneth. My real name was Kenneth, but she didn't tell me this until when I went to kindergarten. So everybody <laughs> in Left Rack City, everybody in Left Rack City, Queens, and everywhere in New York called me Chibs. If you knew me, you called me Chibs, and then she called me Mister Chibs. So it was just special to me, and. It was very, and that's the name of my documentary, Mr. Yeah. Chibs. Tell me about your documentary, because I wanted to ask about that. How did you, you know, uh, did you realize that you had to do something like that? I, I, you know, we, we was they was talking about documentaries at the time, and I was like, wow, let me, let, let's, let's do one. And, uh, Jill Campbell, uh, the, my director, was, was just great. She, she did a hell of a job on my documentary. She saw the she saw it. She saw me, saw what I was going through. And she said, Hey, you know, do you really, really want to do a documentary or you just want to do a documentary? I said, ah, let's do a documentary on my life, you know. So she said, You gotta be honest, you know. And I wasn't, you know, with my wife and you know, my kids, I was on a different life, you know, trying to become a better man, a better father. So I said, Hey, why why not? But you know, I did it and uh it's gotten a lot of praise. Uh, a lot of love, you know, uh, Mr. Chibs. I, I don't want to talk about everything, you know, and I would like for you to go watch it, you know. Um, basketball is easy. Life is hard. That's my motto, you know. Basketball is that, easy. That's true. And, and, and it's, been, that's it's true. been easy my whole my For me, basketball has been easy my whole life, you know, but life has been difficult, been hard for me.